Ciao ragazzi! I've been cup tied with Avondale Football Club as they take on A-League Giants Brisbane Raw at ABD Stadium. And now I've been lucky enough to come to their home ground at Avengers Park to show you some of their rich history. Andiamo! <laughs> Although the club was only founded in 1984, they're the only Victorian club to have been promoted five times in six years. And tonight, they're in the round of 16 of the Australia Cup. Well, here we are. The fans are rolling in, the players are warming up. I'm at ABD Stadium. It's a lot different from Avenger Park today. It's cold, it's windy. I can't wait. I can't wait to meet the players, the staff. Let's hope it's a magical night. How are you feeling, Arch? Yeah, cold. <laughs> Me too. Really what are you cold? expecting from tonight? Um, hopefully the weather will warm up. But I don't, that's highly unlikely. But what I'd really like to see is a cup upset. You don't have an event like this in any other code. And I, and I was talking to someone today about it. It's such a unique event where anyone can play against the elite. And, uh, and that's pretty special. And Avondale have a real opportunity tonight. So my involvement goes the last 15 years with the club. As a player, about five years, I was in goals uh, through the state league uh, divisions. Joined the committee, uh, and now I have the, the pleasure of being president. For Avondale FC, there's, there's, there's a lot of positives happening in the future throughout our female program. Um, I'd love to see us in the B League. Uh, we're working on facilities and stuff, but just getting through tonight and, and pulling off a cup set would be a huge achievement. Huge, huge for the club. The club. Every year we want to go far in the cup and get a team in the A-League and we got that now and fans will come out, everyone will come out to watch us today so it will be a massive, massive thing for the club. You know, we were pretty confident when we played against Wellington Phoenix in the cup last year so, um, you know, we're going to have to do our best, we're going to have to perform well, um, they're very good opposition so, um, but we'll, we'll see how we go. I think it means a lot for the club moving forward. I think they're, they're one of the targets we set at the start of the season to make the last 32. Like I said, we're in the last 16 now and then we're going to give it one hell of a crack tonight. I'm here with super fans Anthony and Bran. Can I just ask, why are you such a big fan of the club? Started about 20 years ago, it's grown so much, um, started playing, was on the board for a few years, now just a big supporter, love the club. I just uh, got connected with the club and all the people here are just fantastic, it's a big old family, it's a great community to be involved in, uh, everyone knows each other, everyone's super friendly, the players, the coaches, the board, the spectators, everyone, it's just a fantastic club to be involved in. It'd be difficult to go past Brisbane. I'd like to see Avondale, but it'd be hard to not see Brisbane win this one. Unfortunately, it wasn't the result that Avondale Football Club wanted, but wow, they put up a fight. I'm leaving feeling so inspired, a club that has grown so quickly in the last few years, and I know the best is yet to come. I'm Sam, and I'm Cup Tide on the Magic of the Cup podcast. <laughs>